important factor in the management of PCOS. For hirsutism, that is uh, seen in some of the cases of PCOS, so hormone inflammation is very important and appropriate treatment or anti androgen I am Dr. S. N. Goswami, retired professor and head of the department of Guwahati Medical College Assam. I like to point out a few points on the clinical management of PCOS. PCOS is an endocrine disorder affecting about 4 to 8 percent of women in reproductive period of life. It is caused by familial and environmental factors and causes problems like menstrual abnormalities, fertility problem and her citizen and many other long term sequelae like diabetes mellitus, hypertension, cardiovascular disorders and cancers of endometrium and breast and ovaries. The mainstay in the management of PCOS is lifestyle management. Weight loss being the most important factor. This weight loss can be achieved by regular exercise, diet control, and reducing carbohydrate intake. Weight loss improves the menstrual function. It helps in ovulation induction and in improving the pregnancy rate. Besides, it also helps in the reduction of diabetes mellitus, hypertension, cardiovascular problems. Avoiding smoking is another important factor in the management of PCOS. For her citizen, that is uh, seen in some of the cases of PCOS, so hormone inflammation is very important and appropriate treatment or anti androgen or oral contraceptive should be used depending on the cases and also some patients may need dexamethasone therapy. Local treatment for hirsutism also may be necessary. Local treatment includes uh, waxing, electrolysis and laser therapy. Infertility treatment includes ovulation induction by chromical citrate or uh, latrozole or GnRH and metformin therapy may be necessary in some of the cases. In some cases, IVF also may be necessary. The surgical treatment for PCOS is rarely necessary. The surgical treatment includes waste reception of the ovaries and laparoscopic ovarian drilling. In conclusion, I like to say that the clinical management of PCOS should be individualized and symptom oriented. The PCOS patient needs long term follow for prevention of different metabolic and other disorders. Thank you.